The polyacrylamides are like sponges, and they have a difference in their pore structure, and the pore structure is related to the ratio of acrylamide monomer and crosslinker, the catalyst, and the method of polymerization. In the next few slides, I'm going to show you some electron microscopy images of three polyacrylamides so that you can see the differences in their morphology. And the, this different geometry of this structure shows why Aquamid allows the ingrowth of cells while the others don't allow this ingrowth and become encapsulated. So this is Aquamid, uh, and this is a cryofrozen fractured Aquamid, and you can see that uh, the pore structure is pretty regular. Uh, the, one, the, uh, on your right, it's um, higher magnification. Uh, it's pretty regular, and uh, it isn't that small, so it allows ingrowth of the fibrous tissue. This is bioalchemid. You can see that the pores are much smaller, but it is, um, it is uh, uneven, and the size of the pores uh, are not even. It's really very chaotic. And this is amazing gel. It's even more chaotic, and, um, and these things tend to stay as uh, boluses, and uh, uh, the fibrous tissue cannot uh, get into the tissue. 